All right, what's up guys, Savvy's Gaming here, and today I'm going to be giving you a little walkthrough of my UI setup, because many of you guys have been asking for this, and uh, I've been trying to get to this, but I've been doing some other videos, rendering, editing, all these other videos, so yeah, um, I finally got around to it, so let's go ahead and jump right into it. All right, so to start this video off, I'm gonna show you how to download LVUI. So what you're gonna wanna go ahead and do is go to your search bar, type in LVUI, not LVUI.com, LVUI Google search, or Safari, whatever you're using, uh, I'm gonna provide a link to this uh, website down in the description below so you don't have to go type through all this. But whatever, uh, lvui-tukui.org, click that, it's gonna take you to the downloads. Uh, don't download tukui, download lvui, go ahead and click download. Um, I've already downloaded it, so it's in my downloads folder, here it is, lvui-8.11.zip. So yes, you need one raw, or if you have one zip, uh, you can use that too. So what you're gonna need is go into your documents folder, go to OS, program files times 86, World of Warcraft, Interface, Add-ons, okay? So now you're gonna wanna open another Documents folder, click here, go to your Downloads, and uh, here's LVI uh, 8.11. Uh, I have 8.07 installed because I haven't reinstalled it, but they do update it quite a lot. So here's uh, LVI uh, 8.11, so you're gonna wanna open this up. Open this with WinZip. Uh, I haven't bought it, so here's a wait a little bit. Uh, use evacuation version, and here it is, LUI and the LUI config. Uh, I already have it, as you can see, right here, but what you wanna do is you're gonna take it here, drag them in your uh, uh, add-ons folder. That's how you install an add-on. All right, guys, so for the sake of this video, I dis I'm going to disable all of my add-ons. They are already disabled, and then I'm just gonna enable LUI and LUI config. That's all I'm gonna use. All right, so once you're in uh, World of Warcraft, you'll be prompted with this LVUI installation screen. So so we're gonna go ahead and go through this whole installation process together. So go ahead and click continue. All right, so uh, CVARs, this part installation process sets up the World of Warcraft default options. It's recommended, so yes, set up CVARs and then continue. Uh, next one is the chat. You can set up chat right now or we can do it later. I'm gonna do it later, so continue. Uh, theme setup, you can do classic. Uh, dark or your class colors. I usually do class colors so that way you can tell when you're fighting in PvP or something what class you're going for. So yeah. Uh, next is the um, resolution you're using. Uh, for me, it is a low resolution. So continue. Uh, the layout, uh, whatever you're at. So this is going to be a balanced druid. So we're going to go physical uh, caster DPS. Physical DPS would be like a warrior. Healer would be priest or paladin. Tank would be paladin or warrior. So cast DPS, continue. Um, aura bars and icons, I'm gonna use that. Uh, continue, and then finished. So while you're doing the setup, it's gonna do quite a bit of reloads. So yes, uh, for technical support, visit us at duckui.org. Uh, disable that and hide. Okay, so I'm gonna show you how to change some things. So let's say you do not like the way the map looks. So you can type in slash LVUI, general. So here you go, general. Uh, Go over here, scroll over here where it says general, this little drop down thing. Do menu map, and you're gonna go ahead and disable. So close that, and uh, like I said, a lot of refreshes. So, uh, except that it's gonna re uh, reload the UI, and there you go, boom. Uh, you have the old blizzard uh, map, just because I don't like the big square that LVUI uses. All right, so next, I'm gonna show you how to uh, edit this uh, health bar right here, and uh, show you how to add a portrait right here a lot of people like that but yes so slash lvy um i'm gonna go ahead and toggle anchors and i'm gonna go ahead and move the player frame right here so you can see me editing it as i go so it's right here uh and then you're gonna go to the talk yeah you're gonna go to lvy and then you're gonna go to player frame see where right here where it says player frame health you're gonna go down and type go to portrait and then click enable. As you can see, it has added the portrait for my character right here. You can model the rotation so you can make it show wherever you want his face. Show how big you want it, like that small. That looks pretty good right there. Uh, camera distance, you can make it to where you see almost his whole body, just his face, you can see right there on his, right there inside of him. <laughs> but yeah, I don't, I'm don't. i not gonna do that. So that looks pretty good right there. So yeah, that's how you uh, put a portrait and add the health bar for your character. All right, so next up we have the chats. So there's two chats, so the general, the combat, and then over here, we have the trade chat. So you can separate those two. And then if you wanna disable the trade chat, you go over here to this little arrow, and you go ahead and right click it, 
or left click it, sorry, and it goes and disappears. And you can just hover back over where the little arrow was, click again, it's back. Also shows your FPS and how much Emma latency you're getting. I'm getting very bad latency right now, so yeah. And it shows how much gold you have, so it's pretty cool. Over here, uh, on the other chat, you yeah, have your garrison resources and your durability, so you know when you need to go repair or something. So yeah, so I'm gonna show you how to edit that. So slash LVI, go to chat, and here it is. So um, there's a couple things, not many things you can do with it, but you can change the whisper alert. So when someone whispers you, you can hear that it was someone whispered you. So you can change it from whisper alert to to none. Uh, Mama weekends, dumb shit. I don't even, I didn't even know these were in here, but yeah, you can change that. Uh, you can change the keyword alert. I have that on none though. And you can also uh, disable the whole chat thing, so which is normal chat. So except it's gonna refresh, go back, and it's the normal chat. But you still have this little uh, this little black thing. So you just go ahead and click the arrow. It's gone. Regular chat. Just the regular World of Warcraft chat. So yeah, that's how you uh, edit the chat in LUI. All right. So next up we have the action bars. So action bars are these things right here. The little bars right here, but you have all of your moves and stuff on. So to see what bar that is, type slash LVI, go over here to toggle anchors, and it will show you down here. As you can see, this is bar one, and that's bar two. So uh, we go to bar one, and you can rechange the size. Buttons per row, uh, the button size, make them real big, make them real small. Put it right there. Make the button spacing really, really huge or really small. I like really small. I think it looks a little bit better. Um, so that's bar one, and you can do the same thing for bar two. Uh, but spacing, put that down, so now they're the same. So yeah, that's, that's really cool. Uh, or if you want, you can just disable the whole thing altogether. But I actually like the, uh, it's all black and everything. I think it looks really, uh, like, pretty professional. So yeah, uh, that's how you mess with the action bar. Alright, so I don't know if you guys have already figured it out, but, uh, to move almost anything in LVI, type slash LVI. Go to toggle anchors and it shows all the stuff you can move so this is where the party frames would be raid frames you can move all that you can move your player frame i like to have it right here target frame target cast bar focus frame focus cast bar put that right there put the, you can uh you can put them exactly aligned you can just click it like that and they're going to go up and that's how you uh, edit that stuff so there target cast bar target frame Focus frame, focus cast bar, you're moving that around, you can move your chat, you can move your bars, your pet bar, arena frame, boss frame, your buffs, your chat, you can move almost anything around. Uh, you could move the map around, but since I disabled it back to blizzards, you cannot move the map around. So yeah, that's how you move around all the stuff in LVI. Alright guys, so that was my LVI add-on uh, setup tutorial thing, but it's, you know, I didn't go too in-depth into it because it's pretty self-explanatory on how to move everything around, change the size of everything. Uh, yeah, so it was a really, really cool add-on. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you next time.